Welcome back to Central PA Live. It's time now for Pet Patrol. I'm joined by Laura Conrad, who is the volunteer coordinator at the Central PA Humane Society. Laura, it's always nice to see you. Always nice to see and you. And well. it's always oh. even up. Oh. Hi. <laughs> it's always even oh. better to see our friend Blue. Oh. Now, oh. this is exactly what happened last time. I'm not sure oh. what it is. I have to tell you guys, during the commercial break, Blue <laughs> is like the sweetest, most calm little thing. We go on air. I think there's something that must hurt his ears or something, maybe with the, with, with being on air or something. I don't know what it is. All of a sudden, he we get on air. He might just have opinions. I don't know, but <laughs> I promise you, at home, he's not a barker. I think it's like fake news that it, that he <laughs> when he does get excited, he does bark. But I mean, he's a four-year-old who's just learning to be how a, be a puppy again. Okay, so. so last time you were here, now I have no room to be talking about weight because God knows I could lose a few pounds myself, but Blue was a little chubby last time he, he was here. He sure was. He and came back to us at like 130 pounds. He is sitting just around 100 now. Yeah, he... It's like keto and area world yeah, guy. Yeah, he's I don't lost, know. He's <laughs> lost some weight. Is, have, is, are you seeing in his health and his personality that he's feeling younger, that he's feeling he's better? so much more spunky now. Yeah. And he just... He's ready for an active family who can help him get the rest of the weight off. Um, he would do best as an only dog in the home, no cats, because he has got that hunting instinct. Sure. Um, but he does get yeah, along that with that can end badly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, he ha he does get along with select female dogs. Right. Okay. Uh, now, what sort of like <coughs> as far as uh, would would it be okay with kids? Yes. Yeah, because mm -hmm. I, I have to tell you, he is, like what I say, he is so fun and loving. He comes right in, and he doesn't jump on you, but he does the, th the nuzzle thing where he kind of mm -hmm. nuzzles your head on, on, your, on your legs, and he just loves spending time with, with everybody. Now, I understand that Central PA Humane Society has a, a night at the races. We don't have a racetrack around here. Explain to me what that is. We don't. What it is, it's an electronic race Derby. Um, you purchase a horse, your horse runs in the race oh. electronically. Oh. So um, it's all the fun oh. of the Kentucky Derby without any her any horses being harmed. And we're having it February 23rd at the East Freedom Fire Hall. Well, I hope everybody goes. It seems like it's going to be a great time. And of course, one of the best causes I can think of because these animals, uh, you guys you, you guys need the funding, right? And, Absolutely. And oh you, my you need all the help you can get. All right. Now, t real quick before you go, tell everybody if they wanted to adopt Blue, and I hope you do because he's a <laughs> wonderful dog. I wish I could adopt him. Tell them how they do it. 942-5402 if you want any other information um, or go to our website. Come on down and meet him at the shelter and maybe you guys are a match. I, uh, Phil, if you're our general manager, Phil, if you're watching upstairs, can we have a station dog? I want Blue around the station. I, He's I, so I good. We should adopt him. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back.